Hey guys, happy Monday from over here in Maui. Woo! Yep. Good morning to good you morning. if it's the morning and good evening if it's the evening. Or good afternoon if it's the afternoon, you all know, right. all different times. <laughs> <laughs> um, we are about to sit down and enjoy breakfast. Steven got Just Egg, and we haven't had Just Egg in quite some time, so we're very looking, much looking forward to it. Yeah. We tried to make omelets. I made and Kylie an omelet. One turned, omelet came mine out. Mine came more of a scramble, but yes. that's okay. It is all right. It, it's still going to be delicious. And I made some avocado toast with the um, sourdough bread that he just picked up from the it's local very store. Very, very good. And we got this peppermint. We got this. This stuff is good. Dark chocolate peppermint almond Dude, cream. highly recommend. Like, I was pleasantly surprised. It's like the perfect amount of peppermint, perfect amount of sweetness. But let me show you what our breakfast looks like. Okay, this is Steven's scramble. We got the toast, we got the coffee, we got the water. And guys, this is our Christmas tree for the year. I know, very, very nice. And then this is the omelet. So he gave me the pretty one because he's so nice. But we are going to dive into that and enjoy. I'm truly never let down by how good Just Egg is. If you have not had it, vegan or non-vegan, like try it just so you can try it because it tastes so legit especially when you make it into like an omelet with the veggies like make it up like you make a normal omelet it is a bit challenging make sure you have a non-stick pan but guys it's so good <laughs> have you had that shirt for babe since 2010 probably maybe 2008 and it's his favorite shirt it he, is he's a he was just asking Honestly, me what he thinks it's made out of and i was like cotton <laughs> i don't like the print anymore now that I'm looking at it in the mirror, this is like the first time I looked at yeah, it. Yeah, I know. This is the, like, you wear it all the time, but this is like the first time I've really looked at it, and it's pretty obnoxious. <laughs> I don't like the print as much as I used to. I used to like really love the print, but I like the, the material it's made out of and the color of like the natural shirt. I mm -hmm. feel like it just feels like it's nice, soft, cotton, natural. And then it's your like, Captain America shirt that you always wear it has a bunch honestly, of holes in that it. That one is really just, it's done. This is done too, but I don't have anything to replace it yet, so I'm gonna hold on to it. All right. Hey guys, so we are getting ready to head to the Kula Lavender Farm. That is probably one of our favorite spots, at least for me. We love Kula. It's like, if you've ever been to Maui, you know. Um, but Maui is not only beach towns and beaches. It actually has like a whole part of the island where it's like country and like rolling hills and like cooler weather because you get higher up in the mountains. And that's Kula. Um, Makawal also, but Kula more so. And it's beautiful. It's so nice up there. Um, so we love going up there. And the lavender farm is really beautiful. It's really spacious. You get a beautiful view of the island. So we're headed there because they're only open on like the weekends and Monday. So if we don't make it on Monday, we don't make it. So we are headed there and we are going to show you around the lavender farm. I'll show you some footage, but I'm really gonna try to stay present in the moment. So we'll see how much footage I get, but stay tuned.
This is definitely like our happy spot. This is our favorite little area to sit in. In Kula, you get the most beautiful view and it's so nice and cloudy and cool. We were just talking about how Paia is constantly sunny and that's where we're living now in the beach town. So it's so nice to escape and come up here. Yeah, you're at a slant. I can't do it. I can't. I can do a headstand. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. That's 
so hard because it's not flat. <laughs> More than anything, Stephen and I have been focusing on utter presence. Being here right now in the present moment. Enjoying the little things enjoying the sound and the feeling of our breath as it goes in and as it comes out. Reminding ourselves that truly the only moment we will ever have is right here in the now. So take a deep breath in with us and soak in all the beauty that life truly has to offer you in each and every single little moment. Hey guys, wild hair. That's just like prone to happen when you live in Maui. Um, so this is how we're celebrating Christmas this year, just by like filling up on all of the Christmas drinks. And we just got gingerbread lar bars. Very excited. And I wanted to let you know, well, Steven will say the recipe. We just ordered, a, it literally tastes like Chips Ahoy latte. And here is the recipe if you would like it totally vegan all also, of course, because we're both vegan. So if you would like to order that ever at Starbucks, here's the recipe. It's a soy mocha with chestnut praline added in. And like, depending on your size, I think tall, probably one pump, grande and venti, probably two pumps with no whip and a chestnut praline topping on top. It's so Very. good, it's really good. If you don't want it to be too chocolatey though, probably like a little bit less on the mocha, but it's really good. Yeah, highly recommend. Get you in the Christmas spirit. You get the little, you get the little Christmas cups now, you know? I mean, definitely, you know, I, I don't know if anywhere is letting you bring your own cups anymore. They definitely don't do it here in Maui. Um, but, you know, of course, bring your own cup if you can. Um, but l l let's try these gingerbread lar bars. They're gonna be good. Hey. Hey guys. So that was a very successful day. It was day. such a beautiful day. We spent probably a good two hours at the lavender farm, just like picking all these different spots to sit and literally just look at nature and just like we were in. I feel like we were both in a very meditative state, like the whole time we were there. So it was so nice. But we are back home, all cozied up, ready to mm -hmm. have some dinner, and yeah, just chill out for the rest of the night. Maybe we'll watch a Christmas movie. Yes, yeah, we're like in that. We already watched the one, what was it called? Love Hard. Love Hard. That was a pretty cute one. Like, it's like, you know, you expect what's gonna happen, but it was really cute. Mm -hmm. It was really cute, so I recommend that. Um, but yeah, 
it was fun recording this for you guys and I hope you enjoyed it. And if you want to like stay in tune with, you know, what we're up to, you can always subscribe to our channel and like this video. Um, Give it a thank thumbs you. up. Yeah, seriously. Um, thank you for being here. And I said, I send my love to all of you and I hope you have a beautiful rest of your day. Namaste. See you next time.